So let's say you want to start recording videos on YouTube or do a live stream on Twitch on your PC. But the thing is, how do you do that? Well, that's why I'm here to teach you guys how to install OBS for 2021 and 2022. So stick around and I'll see you guys there. What's up, everyone? My name is Jeff Eco to the Oiko, and today I'm going to show you guys how to install OBS Studio. So, without any further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So, the first thing you want to do is open up your web browser. I'm using Microsoft Edge, for example. So, you want to go to google.com. And you want to search OBS Studio. Click here on this link. So this will actually ask you to download like the latest release. So if you're wondering on Windows, then download the Windows installer. If you're using macOS, download the macOS file. So I'm going to go ahead and download Windows and I'm actually going to save it on my desktop or probably on my downloads folder, probably on my downloads folder. So now that you have your OBS Studio software downloaded, so the first thing you want to do is right click and click on run as administrator. This will open a little message saying you want to have this install your device and it says here welcome to OBS studio this will help you install you know, OBS studio so this is like the installation wizard all right so just read through the license information and hit next and then I think it's best if you just leave it on your C drive so if you're updating OBS, then yes, you may also be able to keep all your files. So nothing has changed once you update the latest firmware of OBS. But if this is your first time installing OBS, then you'll also get the new update patch as well. Now, so once it's done installing, All right now we're going to launch OBS Studio. And as it turns out, I was going to actually record this installation throughout Streamlabs, but since Streamlabs is also OBS, I can't really do that. So So yeah, this is my interface right here, so but I'm going to show you guys, you know, a few bit of basics so, um, I'm going to go through the auto configuration wizard. So, if this is your first time setting up OBS, you will have this message here. Your auto configuration wizard. So, it will ask you to optimize your streaming or record secondary. Choose whatever it is that one of you are looking for then hit next and you know depending on your PC uh, you might want to actually check your PC specs before doing this so yeah so I got most of my stuff already set up for you guys so you know this is just to show what it looks like all right so now you have OBS installed um, you know you want to might add your scenes and for my starting soon screen I actually used placeit.net this is where I use for my um, starting screen soon so you can customize your own starting screen or ending screen 
or and you must have like your email account in order to um actually sign in to place it yeah i will also link that in the description below so yeah that's how you install obs studio i'm actually going to guide through a few bit of um advanced things throughout obs so um if you have any questions just leave it in the comment sections below so anyway that's all thank you guys so much for watching and i'll be sure to do more obs studio tutorials later in the future anyway thanks again see you all and have a good day